All right, some story about some white trash. They must have saved their entire money up just to go out to dinner. I mean, it must have been everything they had, or someone died and left them a few bucks, something. Okay. Now, when I, the woman's name is Isabella. Now, I, when I think of the name Isabella, or Isabella, I, I don't think of a white trash name. I don't. No, I think of a classy stripper. Her name is Isabel <laughs> Laster. She's from Sherman, Texas, and her husband's name is James. They were visiting Nashville, Tennessee. I told you, man, they, they must have saved up everything they got. Mm. Take this trip to Nashville. Uh, earlier this week. And on Monday night, they were at one of those Japanese hibachi restaurants where the chef cooks your food right in front of you. Don't worry, I got sound bites of this white trash in a minute. Oh, okay. good. Okay. And when it was time for the chef to squirt some water on the grill, instead of using a spray bottle, he used a toy. Now, it's a plastic figure, picture this, of a boy who squirts water when his pants are down, like he's peeing. He's peeing. Mm-hmm. But there's no... Penis. Okay. It's just okay. It's it's funny. Yeah. And the chef was messing around, and he he squirted the woman. Mm-hmm. I don't know if he accidentally squirted her. A little bit got in her eye. She and James were mortified. <gasps> this is like the payday. This is like the redneck lottery right here. Oh God. She says, "Quote: I peed myself. Basically, one of those wee wee area." It was in this wee wee area. Wrong choice of words. Oh my! Now, you know God. what? It's better to hear it from the people oh, themselves okay. than from your radio guy this morning. This is just white trash. The folks at Wasabi Japanese Steakhouse in Murfreesboro say, along with dinner, fire's coming. Diners yeah, get a show. Them. But now one diner says last night she thinks the cooks here showed a little too much. Now you did this before. You, you know, oh yeah. Your, your job I, I, is I put all kinds of stuff into my it, routine. It's to it's to entertain people yeah. while they eat. It's I love hibachi grills. Don't Absolutely. we? That's what most people do. It's fascinating. I, but I'm not a lawsuit type of person who's always thinking lawsuit. There are those people out there, you know. Just I can sue. I can sue. And this is trash. Who's thinking it's payday? Of the little guy in the cook's hand. I like to hold that water. Just like that. Here's a closer yeah. look. You hold a sign. I described it perfectly. They did a little plastic toy. But yeah. The pants come down and it, it scoots water like a, a water gun. But there's there's no there's no there's no a, a penis showing. So water come out. A plastic toy that yeah. sprays water, made it. to look like the figure is urinating when its toy pants are lowered. I love that the news crew had to do a story on this. <laughs> <laughs> Last night at dinner, Wasabi Restaurant admits one of the chefs shot some of the water in the face of one of its customers. Oh my God! It's it's just little how little. dare you? It peed on me. <laughs> <laughs> it peed on me. Oh God! It peed. I was mortified. Me. I can't spell that word. But I was mortified. I was mad. I can't spell that either. <laughs> <laughs> hey, don't worry, though. We're getting paid next vacation. We're going to Branson. We sold everything we had to go on a trip to Nashville. It was going out to dinner time. Mm-hmm. And we were having some dinner. He he got me with that little boy. Little boy <laughs> wee-weed on me. I told you we should have went to Gatlinburg. Customers. It peed on me. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Ian, you you know this is this is radio, so people can't see, but we're all imagining something. It's pretty much what you were imagining by that vocal. The- yep, I couldn't even see it till I looked over. Yeah, that's about what I expected. Just pure white trash. Yeah. Okay. Picture any uh, middle-aged white trash woman who looks who's probably thirty and looks sixty. Yeah. yeah. Rough <laughs> life. Yeah. Rough Unless life. you're driving, close your eyes. Picture that woman. Whatever you're thinking, you got it. <laughs> they're they're interviewing her. It looks like in a hotel room. Yeah, looks like it. Just, I mean, they sold everything well, they got. Everything they or someone died and left them something. Basically, they shot water out of its penis. How's that? Out of but it don't have a penis. It, it doesn't have a penis. It's wee wee area. Is it? <laughs> wow. Oh. <laughs> How's that? Out of its wee wee area. Is <laughs> Isabel and James Lasseter. Embarrassing. Go on TV. These folks ought to be ashamed of this. I guess for them it's fame, man. We we made yeah. the we made the six o'clock news. We we are it's yeah. A Can't get over fame. that. <laughs> hey, <laughs> right? hey, some people standards are here we're really low. That's true. And you know ours ours is we're average people's. You know yeah. I think most of us are here, and these people are like you know way down there. 
Does that make sense? Here on a job from Texas say they were mortified when the chef essentially made the toy urinate water on Isabel. In front of our minor children and grandchildren. Oh my God, who cares? Lawsuit. I'm sure the kids thought it was hilarious. Yeah, they did. <laughs> we're going to dinner. I think we just hit the redneck lottery. It really didn't have a winner, but you got the point. They <laughs> <laughs> were so upset, they even called the police, really? citing assault. It was a sexual style of assault on my wife. No, it wasn't. That doesn't even make sense. No. Police also noted the doll wasn't, well, anatomically correct. But Isabel and James say that doesn't matter. I mean, that, just because yeah, it, it does. doesn't have a weenie. Just because somebody's... <laughs> yeah. Lord, Lord, yeah. Make her stop talking. <laughs> Over here, that's okay. It doesn't matter. I mean, that, that, just because it, it doesn't have a weenie. Just because somebody... <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Dumb bitch, go home. This woman right here. Oh, my God. Oh, my cut off that little piece of plastic to say, okay, it's not there anymore, doesn't change the fact that you're getting peed on. Yeah. <laughs> you're not. It's not me! I thought this was fake last night. I had to verify it. Oh, the general manager, Johnny Huang. Yeah, I part of you. I like his name. His name kind of fit Johnny Wang. <laughs> <laughs> of course his name is Johnny Wang. <laughs> yeah, I really the general manager, Johnny Huang, yeah, I that. says he apologizes to the family and that he's never had any complaints about the toy before. And the kid like it. He like it. They pay the water. They think just a water gun, kind of like a water gun, you know. <laughs> now he says like chefs it, wrong will at least ask permission Thank you. before showing more of the toy boy again. Wow. I you believe that's real? Well, no. unfortunately, yes, I do. Yeah, you get all kinds working hibachi. It, those are the people that would have walked away from my table. This ain't a legitimate experience. They should have been stabbed. I know. It's like, <laughs> I wanted Johnny Wayne, not random black guy. <laughs> this guy told me he was black and these. Now, I don't have a wee wee. Now, now what, what kills me is that in a lot of hibachi places, you, you open up the show with, with with a little game where you toss things into people's mouths. I mean, like, like right. me personally, I, I would have a, you know, an upside down bowl of shrimp that was steaming on the side and play a little game where you toss the shrimp in their mouth. You know, they try to catch it, blah, blah, blah. So if you're down for that kind of stuff, you know, why why are you so upset that because oh, because this is pure white trash who has never probably been out in anywhere nice in their entire life from what I'm looking at here and yeah I'm being very judgmental. Go ahead. And it looks go like ahead. they have probably sent everything they spent everything they've got in the savings account to go to this place they can't pronounce hibachi. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know what the hell hibachi was. They thought that's one of them Asian guys that's got a uh, fire and he and he. he he moves stuff on the grill. That's how they would describe where they went. When we would say, man, I went over to the hibachi grill. To them, they went out to a fancy dinner. And then it got real. Then they got sexually assaulted. Uh-huh. But Where by was the a sexual boy in no the wiener. assault? There was no sexual in the assault. <laughs> there was no assault. <laughs> the news had to put this on just for the, the pure sake of entertaining of their audience. Oh, you know it. You know, and, and, and thoroughly entertaining it is. Oh man! So do they go on? I mean, are, are they going to go on, on, on uh, you know, onto a, a lawsuit here? If I was a judge, I'd put them in jail. I would. For real. And I throw this out. You hold this eye, and I push up. So water. I love this lady. A plastic toy that yeah. sprays water, made it. to look like the figure is urinating. That's a great story to run on your news station. <laughs> Last night at dinner, Wasabi Restaurant admits one of the voice. chefs shot some of the water in the face of one of its customers. It peed on me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh my! She is tripping so hard. <laughs> Did I not I, tell you? Oh. Prerequisite. I said I, I've got a sexual song case. <laughs> the you only did, people, now. the you only did. people that could be offended by anything I may have said this morning would be pure white trash. But they, they're probably so damn stupid they don't even know what a hibachi grill is and know what the hell I'm talking about. I'm picking your, over their head. Your white trashery makes you ignorant. Yes. Uh, let me get to Nathan. He's got a comment <laughs> on that. Hey, Nathan. What's up, brother? Yeah. yeah. Hey, I was gonna uh, point out something. I called on the uh, audio back, guys. They, uh, the the gentleman said that they had minor children and grandchildren. I mean, if that ain't white trash, I don't know what is. How do your underage kids have kids? <laughs> is that what he said? What he I, did I say he had mi- minor children and grandchildren. Yeah, I caught that. Yeah. Uh-huh. Well, uh-huh. maybe he has. You know, what well, that didn't necessarily mean it was a, the, the like the sixteen year old kid's daughter or a you know, kid. It could have been. It could have been grandchildren, and then they have another daughter who their own daughter is not old enough. It could have been, but could have been. But I'm gonna go with you, Nathan. I'm, it's probably what you said. It's probably what you said. Thanks, Nathan. Good point. Thank you, man. That is a fantastic <laughs> point. <laughs> I don't know how the hell they have, see. They must have hit the redneck lottery. I know he says work, but I don't know if I'm gonna buy that part of the story. Mm-hmm. This was everything sure. they had left to go to some fancy dinner, and they're like, "Hey, you got a lawsuit." Because, you know, Rick will tell you this. A lot of people love to play. I see this all the time, too. People love to play attorney like they know what the hell they're talking all about. Right. So they're thinking, this is a quick lawsuit. Right. That's that's dumb as hell. <laughs> they probably think lawsuit's two words. 